In this video, we will see how to debug non-texted charts using Caliber RVE. My name is Srinivas Veliwala, a TME for Caliber. In addition to the texted charts that are caught as part of the extraction process, there are non-texted charts that are generating that are generated during the LVS comparison process. Non-texted charts are actual connectivity issues that have been analyzed and found to be a short. For example, in this case, there is a short between source nets N3 and N1. To help fix this non-texted charts, designers can use the Caliber RVE visual representation of the layout and source net list. This is very helpful, especially if you do not have any external schematics in your external design environment. So to debug the non-texted chart, we should proceed from the source net list information, which is considered the golden data. Using this, users can separately highlight the instances on the source nets corresponding to the shorted layout net and trace the good segments to find the bad one. So I start the debug process by highlighting the source net N3 and N1 both in RVE schematics as well as in Calibre Design Draft. So you can see that once I highlight uh, both the nets, they are highlighted both in the layout as well as in the in the source schematic. And in the layout, since it's a shorter net, you only see the highlight for net uh, 13. So I start the debug process by trying to highlight the devices on both the nets uh, N1 and N3 in the source so that I can identify the good segments of the of the shorter net uh, to find the location of the shot. Once I finish highlighting the devices on net N1, I highlight the devices on source net N3 as well. So I click on the highlight uh, mechanic, uh, highlight operation and this highlights both the nets. So once I finish uh, the highlight of both the devices on, on both the nets, I can visually look at this layout to basically identify the devices that are present on source net N1 and the devices that are present on source net N3. So by visually looking at this, I can identify that the location of the shot is somewhere between both these highlights. So I zoom into that particular location and sure enough, I can see a polygon which looks like a shot. So I clear my highlights uh, select this polygon and use the delete operation in Calibre Design Ref to delete this polygon. Now that I have deleted, uh, deleted the polygon, I launch an LVS run to verify that I have indeed uh, fixed the shot uh, with my edit. And you can see after the run is complete that uh, my edit has actually fixed the shot. And the same mechanism that I have used to debug uh, shots can also be used in external design environments such as Virtuoso and uh, Laker and other layout editors in which Calibre is integrated. Hope this video was helpful to you. Thank you.